In Chapter 26 of Jane Austen's Sense and Sensibility, after a three-day journey, Eleanor, Marianne, and Mrs. Jennings arrive in London. Marianne wastes no time sending a letter to Willoughby. When a carriage arrives after dinner, she throws herself at the drawing room door, expecting Willoughby, but storms from the room when Colonel Brandon arrives hmm? instead. Eleanor and Mrs. Jennings speak with Brandon, who mentions the Palmers, and the whole group has tea. After Brandon's departure, no one else arrives, nor do any letters. Marianne's spirits revive in the morning when Charlotte Palmer stops in and invites them to go shopping. She hopes to see Willoughby while they're out, but she doesn't, and returns disappointed to find he still hasn't written her back. Eleanor wishes Mrs. Dashwood hadn't allowed Willoughby to court Marianne in so doubtful, so mysterious a manner. It's clearly affected her passionate younger sister in detrimental ways. In Chapter 27 of Sense and Sensibility, Marianne takes comfort the next morning in the thought that mild weather must have kept Willoughby hunting at his country estate. Colonel Brandon visits often to look at Marianne and talk to Eleanor. A week after their arrival, Willoughby calls while they're out. Marianne anxiously awaits his return the next morning, but he neither returns nor writes. Marianne refuses to confide in Eleanor, saying Eleanor doesn't confide in her. Meanwhile, Lady Middleton has sent Mrs. Jennings an invitation for the next evening. Mrs. Jennings and both Dashwood sisters go. When they return from the gathering, which included an unplanned dance, Marianne is sad and tired. Mrs. Jennings is surprised Willoughby wasn't there because Sir John had met Willoughby in town that day and invited him personally. Now Eleanor worries even more about Marianne, who writes yet another letter to Willoughby the next morning. Brandon arrives to speak with Eleanor privately. Hesitantly, he asks whether rumors of Marianne and Willoughby's engagement are true. He reveals his own love for Marianne and wishes her all imaginable happiness, hoping that Willoughby will try to deserve her. In Chapter 28 of Sense and Sensibility, days later, Eleanor and Marianne attend a party with Lady Middleton. At the party, Eleanor mm. spots Willoughby speaking with a very fashionable young woman. He bows slightly to Eleanor. Marianne lights up and rises to go to him. Eleanor tries to hold her back, but Marianne calls Willoughby affectionately and holds out her hand. He greets Eleanor formally, asking after her mother. Marianne confronts him and demands to know the meaning of Willoughby's strange behavior. After a brief, proper exchange where he withholds his emotions, Willoughby bows and returns to the young woman's side. Marianne, heartbroken and close to fainting, wants to force him to explain, but Eleanor persuades her to wait for a more private moment. Willoughby soon leaves, and Lady Middleton helps Eleanor take Marianne home. Marianne goes to bed, and Eleanor angrily realizes that whatever understanding had existed between her sister and Willoughby is over.